go through everything and then come back? Well, no, tell me. I usually prefer to, but tell me what's wrong. All right, I just think the, the very opening could be a little... Nothing is more important than the simple act of people getting together. What? Could I have just one more take of that? Sir? Why? I just did it right. Yeah. I, look, I, I'm not used to having more than one person in there. One more word out of you and you go. Is that clear? Yes, sir. I take, well, I take directions from one person under protest. But from two, I don't sit still. But who the hell are you, anyway? No, I'm the engineer. Well, why the hell are you asking me for another one? Well, I thought there was a slight bunk, and I would like, just like to be safe. Jesus. What is a gonk? Do you mind telling me what that is? A bang from outside. A bang from outside. Could I see Mrs. Rogers for a minute, please? Mrs. Buckley lives. Every July, peas grow there. Do you really mean that? I, yeah, so in other words, I, I, I'd start half a second late. Don't you think you really want to say July over the snow? Isn't that the fun of it? It's, it if you can, you can make it almost when that shot disappears, it'll make my... I think it's so nice that, that you see a snow-covered field and say every July, peas grow there. We know a remote farm in Lincolnshire where Mrs. Buckley lives. Every July, peas grow there. We aren't even in the fields, you see. Yeah, we are. We're talking about them growing, and she's picked them. Yeah. <coughs> On what? On in July. Okay. I don't understand you, then. When must, what must be over for a July? Um, when we get out of that snowy field. When I was out, we were onto a can of peas, a big dish of peas, when I said in July. Oh, I'm sorry. Wasn't yes, that? always. Yeah. I'm always past that. Yes. Well, that's about where I say in July. You emphasize a bit in. In July. Why? That doesn't make any sense. Sorry. Um, There's no known way of saying an English sentence in which you begin a sentence with in and emphasize it. Get me a jury and show me how you can say in July and I'll go down on you. That's just idiotic if you'll forgive me by saying so. That's just stupid. In July. I'd love to know how you emphasize in and in July. Impossible. Meaningless. I think all they were thinking about was that they didn't want to. He isn't thinking. Well, sir, can we just do one last Yeah. Time? And it was my fault. I, should, I said in July. If you can leave every July. You didn't say it. He said it. Your friend. Every July? No, you don't really mean every July. But that's a that's bad copy. It's in July. Of course it's every July. There's too much directing around here. Norway. Fish fingers in Nor Findus, Norway. We know a certain fjord in Norway, near where the cod gather in great shoals. There, Janste Stangeland. Fraction more on the on that shoals thing, because you roll it around very nicely. Yeah, roll it around, and I have no more time. You don't know what I'm up against, because it's full of, of, of things that are only correct because they're grammatical, but they're tough on the ear. You see, this is a very wearying one. It's unpleasant to read, unrewarding, because Findus frees the cod at sea and then add a crumb crisp, ooh, crumb crisp coating. Uh, that's tough, crumb crisp coating. I think no, because of the way it's written, you need to break it up because it's not it's not as conversationally written. What? Take crumb Fish out. Away. Take crumb out. Good. Here under protest is beef burgers. We know a little place in the American Far West where Charlie Briggs chops up the finest prairie fed beef and tastes. This is a lot of shit, you know that. You want one more? Yes, yes, more yes, on yes, what beer? Yes, yes, you, you missed the first beef, actually, completely. What do you mean, missed it? You're emphasizing prairie fed. But you can't emphasize beef. That's like he's wanting me to emphasize in before July. Come on, fellas, you're losing your heads. 
I wouldn't direct any living actor like this in Shakespeare. Well, you do this. It's impossible. Orson, you did six last year, and by far and away the best, and I know the, the reason. The right reading for this is the one I'm giving it. At the moment. I spent 20 times more for you people than any other commercial I've ever made. You are such pests. Now, what is it you want? No, I think... In your depths of your ignorance, what is it you want? Whatever it is you want, I can't deliver because I just don't see it. That was absolutely fine. It really was. You, you can't... It isn't worth it. No money is worth it. 